I'm, um, I'm rolling. I'm rolling now. So oh, hi. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the scare attraction. I'm JP, one of the actors. In each room you're going to enter has a particular theme. We have several themes. We have the escape room, which is the creme de la creme, a little bit like um, uh, Saw, if you remember that film. Uh, we have the clown room. We have uh, the uh, boxing room and the mafia room. Uh, I'm taking over today. Don't worry about uh, Kathy. That's, that's irrelevant. Uh, but if you want to follow me, and I'll show you around. Yeah? Come on. Oh, yes. Let me introduce you to our uh, excellent stills photographer, Mr. Gaz De Vere. Um, uh, by the way, Gaz, where does the De Vere come from? I was just... Uh, completely made up. Oh, completely so made up. up. Oh, well, there you go. Right, OK, come follow me. OK, right. Oh, Jake, Silas, hello. say hello to camera. These are our fabulous uh, production crew, uh, and, and obviously he's been uh, having, uh, well, I don't know, is it tomato ketchup or is it blood? I can't know, remember which it is. <laughs> you don't want to know. Sweet, though. Does it really? Think, yeah. oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, well, we'll ask somebody else to taste that later. Anyway, come over here, guys. <laughs> right, okay, now, I've really got to tell you about this place. It's probably about, what, 400 years old? As you can see with the building, it's quite dilapidated. Now, if you focus over here, there's a very interesting story about... There you go, guys, interrupting me again. Bloody hell, you know, what can you do? Anyway, so, the, uh, this particular building, we've seen a, uh, a uh, boy and a mother. And there's a very interesting story about the boy and the mother. Because apparently, I think it was about 150 years ago, uh, the uh, mother was alienated with her child, and so she threw him downstairs. And as a result, we can hear footsteps, and very eerie footsteps. Hopefully, well, it depends on how much you pay. We might hear them tonight. Okay, now, over here, the uh, window straight in front, you can see the chandelier. Now, I've seen that swing on many different occasions, and to be honest with you, it's, uh, it's, it's really eerie and, um, I, um, that's another story. Anyway, let's move on. So one of our first rooms, this is probably the creme de la creme. We're all paying customers, like I'm bashing into any walls where I'm going along here. It's probably the eerie presence. This is the escape room where all um, uh, our paying customers love this room because it's a little bit like, do you remember when I was saying Saw, where each character, they don't know, um, usually they don't know, uh, the, the, the other characters. So, as you can see, the way it's positioned is pretty good. Uh, we've got a countdown uh, clock there. Um, yes. All oh, right, thank you, mate. Uh, sweet, isn't it? I like it. Or oh, am I sweet enough? I'm, of course I'm sweet enough, you know. I mean, but anyway. Anyway, so, um, what I was going to do is I was going to sit down here in the dentist chair. Uh, perhaps uh, Silas might be able to uh, extract... Um, extract my wisdom teeth, although yeah. I can't remember when I last had them out, actually. Did you, did, did you do that, by the way? I'm sure you did. Uh, OK, OK, fine. Um, I'm going to get a pen knife. Well, that's not going to work, is it? It's not. It's pretty blunt. Um, uh, it's got a really sharp little oyster tool on it. Which oh, really? Just oh, OK, OK. Um, just... Anyway, am I feeling anything at the moment? Mm, probably not, actually. I mean, the clock... <laughs> It's not actually, well, it's not actually counting down, to be honest, but it's stopped. Why is that? Why is it stopped? I don't quite understand that. I mean, just focus on that, Steve, actually. I mean, I'm, I'm, I, yeah, it's, it's going up and then going down. I mean, I, I can't explain that, can you? I really can't. Anyway, anyway, so as I say, this is the escape room. We're now going to move on to the next room which is the down room. So please, follow me. Honestly, you can't get the staff. Dear me. Oh my God, oh my God, please, no! No! Correct me if I'm wrong. Did that actually happen or, or not? Or am I imagining it? I don't know. Um, but I feel really perturbed. Uh, 
Silas, did that actually happen? I don't know. Okay, well, shout, a a masked right. killer just came in here. I don't, I'm, I, is he one of our actors? Who? Uh, on camera. Uh, no. Really? No, no not I on so, uh, oh, okay. Oh, okay. Anyway, anyway, uh, let's go on to our clown, moon, uh, clown uh, room and meet um, uh, our actors, and I believe we'll have our makeup artist in there as well. So please come in. There you go. After you. Ken, how you doing, hey, buddy? The behind the scenes. How you doing? Yes, good, yes. Good. How you doing? Yeah, good. Yeah. And it's Bella, isn't it? Yeah, hi. Right. Okay. So, Ken, tell me, what's it like being a clown? I mean, well, I know you're very funny. Anyway. It's funny, do you know what I mean? I'm always clowning around. Get it? Yeah, uh, he's very funny, <laughs> she isn't loves he? It, though. Yeah. Anyway, next question, Bella. Yeah. So, tell me something about this wonderful clown mask Which one? that you've. Uh, well, indeed. I mean, I suppose the question is for you. Uh, is which one do you prefer wearing? I prefer that one, because that one's like putting a condom on your head. It's too tight, do you know what I mean? But He'd know that why. <laughs> Can, there's <laughs> ladies <laughs> present. Not that funny. Before. Right, okay, okay. But yeah, I'm gonna wear the red hair mask. She thinks it's ginger, I think it's, it's red. Fine. Right, why are you wearing this one tonight? Um, it's scary, do you know what I mean? I'm, I'm looking forward to scaring people. Brown. I love, I love scaring people. Yeah, I'm, I'm always yeah, been a prankster. I much though. prefer the other one, actually. Really? You know, yeah. Because I can't it's, see out of it. it. Well, that's the idea. You know. Anyway, anyway, <laughs> let's move on, guys. Let's move. See you later. Next room. See you later. Bye bye. bye. I hate that guy. Call him the Max Oh, really? You're better. Come on. I'm going to get Kathy to sack him later. Right, anyway, uh, on to the business in hand. Now we're going into the Mafia room. And of course, we've got uh, yes. a lovely Jake there sorting yeah. sorting uh, weapons out. Hi, how are you going? <laughs> What's he doing? Hello, Willie. How are you, Jimmy? You're supposed to be here rehearsing with us. Rehearsing me? You're supposed to be what? Sat, you're yeah. supposed to be sat down. Listen, I'm always on book. I yeah, don't need to, to rehearse. You know. So we haven't done any rehearsing at all. Yeah, but you. Need what do we need to rehearse? rehearse? So so we know listen, do it. People spontaneity are is people what are paying, is the key. JP. Yes, but what we say is spontaneity, you say, oh, no, that's Hey, listen, wrong. excuse me, at least I put some performance in it. What do uh, you do? Excuse me, what do you I do? Perform. All you do what? is you twist the case to the position where it should not be. JP, and so I, 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 I screw up as a result. Oh, can we just sit down, rehearse yes. this? And we'll I don't on. need to rehearse. Oh, uh, by the way, uh, where are you going? I'm going through there. To do what? No, no. <laughs> No, excuse me, excuse me. Listen, I'm the one that does this, not you. Kathy's given me permission, not you. No, no, I was told to do it. Really? No, come on. And when did that happen? Two days ago, when you were... Yeah, OK, you were with Anyway, no. so what are you going to do then? You're going to introduce the boxing guys, yes? yes. OK, <laughs> right, OK. Hello. Yeah. Uh, championship yes, boxing. Oh, I know about championship Who's boxing, win, but anyway. Right. Uh, well, that's obvious. If these don't stick to rehearsals like last time, you're getting knocked clean out. He needs some proper rehearsals, mate. I tell you that. Yeah, I'm so. What's a cheap shot? I think we're meant to go. I could do better standing here, to be honest with you. Anyway, guys, listen, come on. Hey, 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 come on. Break it up. I mean, do I have to get in there and sort it out? Come on, break it up. Break it up. Hey, hey, hey. Come on, break it up. Right. You go this way. Come on. Come on, follow me now. This is the main hall. This is where all the action will be taking place later. Now, what? this is our super clown. Brilliantly funny. I've seen him already, well, but yeah. He, th he thinks he's right. funny. Well, now, what are you doing? I'm showing him around. I'm the one who's supposed to be showing people around? Well, JP's showed him around before me. Oh my is... God, I don't care who started it. Why is it happening? Well, you weren't here. I've been here this whole time. I'm sorting out the costumes. Speaking well, of which, why isn't everyone ready? Uh, They'll be here in a minute. We're ready. We're ready. We're ready. We're ready. We're this doesn't look ready to me. What? Oh. Eyes on them. I don't... What, what do you need to do now? Isn't it? What's the it's problem anyway, Kevin? Listen! Get that off! You need to get them to hold for 20 minutes. They're not ready. Bunch of fucking amateurs. We need to hold here. They're not ready yet. 
bloody amateurs. What are we actually doing here? Will Drake be there? Drake is just making us wait. They're not ready for you yet. Should have done the baker job. You know, much more money and much nicer than this shithole. What the fuck are we doing here? Why are they making us wait? Drake just wants everything ready for your arrival. Yeah, well, they better be. Do they know who we are? I'm sure some of them have heard of you. I'm sorry, was that a sarcasm? You do literally know I can get rid of you with a click of my fingers? <sighs> just remember you work for me, yeah? I could easily get rid of you. We're ready. OK, they're ready. Less than I thought it'd be. And can I just say what an honor it is to welcome you to our attraction? These are our fabulous performers who will be entertaining you today. I'll show you around, but we all chip in and interact with everyone, so I'll be popping in and out of the room. Right. Guys, let's give them the best show we can. Let's get to it. Move. What is that with him? Jake. What even is this shit? You say it's going to be mainstream. Prime time, that's how you pitched it. Yeah, I saw literally one photographer, there was one. Boys and girls. Uh, don't boys and girls us. What the fuck are we doing here? This is doing nothing for our image. What it is, is a grander piece for a 30 minute walk around. All you gotta do is go in there, take a few selfies, share a few, and come out. Now pout those lips and grow up just for the next 30 minutes. Fine. But I want a five-star hotel with all of the extras. OK. Do you understand? Yes. Now, go and do your thing. <laughs> Shall we get started? <sighs> yeah, let's get this shit over done with. I need you to be on form today. You know, we've got to really impress them, yeah? OK? Really impress them, you know? They're paying a lot of money to be here, so I want you to really impress them, right? We all ready? Yeah? Anyway, this is Yeah? Yeah? OK. Yeah? Welcome to Fight Club. Now, the first rule of Fight Club is that nobody talks about Fight Club. The second rule of Fight Club is that nobody talks about Fight Club! Right, it's the 15th round. I need some real encouragement. In the right corner, winner of 32 professional fights, 31 knockouts, the unstoppable sex machine, the Earl of Norwich! In the left corner, winner of 31 professional fights, 29 KOs, the Dagenham Destroyer, Durso! <laughs> right, ladies and gentlemen, you've reached a critical point. We're in the 15th round, okay? The final round. I need some encouragement, okay? Right, guys, right, listen. <sighs> It's really important here we impress them, okay? Right? Watch your kidney punches, watch your low blows, right? Okay? Ready? Touch gloves, right? Okay. Fight, box! Come on, Andy, come, come on. Come on. Andy, come on. Come on, come on. Come on, 
Okay, 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 break, 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 break. You okay? You okay? Yeah, you okay? One, two, three. Okay, box touch, gloves, fight. Come on, get him. Oh, he's in back. Okay, gentlemen, let's have a great show. Uh, who's got the weapons? Me. Weapon pole? Right, okay. Can you look beautiful? Come on, we've got to go. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. This is our mafia room. Look at it out. Oh my god, chill out. What? Started making an appearance. <clears throat> this is deadly serious. Are these the dumb schmucks who were saving the money? Yeah, best thing was. They had the case. I saw them. We've seen on CCTV footage. It was them. Let's hurt them. Here's the box, box. Where's my money? I'm talking to you! Shirley? Yes? Can we those pillows at the hotel, yeah? You know how I like them. Did I give you permission to speak? Why, why are you shouting that big man? You, you dumb fucks! Where's my fucking money? <laughs> so he's part of the part of the game. Fuck it, I'll carry on, sorry. Shall I slap him, boss? Yeah, slap him real hard. <laughs> Forget about it. I just want my fucking money. <laughs> it's a bit shit, isn't it? Mm. <laughs> Oi. Just look like you're trying to enjoy yourself, yeah? We'll put a lot of time and effort into this. Don't fuck it up. I don't want it. What's that goddamn smell? Probably one of Jimmy's farts. Very funny. Well, well, well. I recognize that smell anywhere. It's you who two stole from me. In situations like this, you gotta ask yourself a question. Do you feel lucky? Well, do you, tongues?
What are we changing into now? Oh, that was disastrous. In fact, call the agent. Oh, we're doing a boxing. Gig after this. Is a boxing one, yeah? Come on, darling, maybe look beautiful. Come on, darling, maybe look beautiful. So you get behind Jake, behind the tree. Can you get round that way or not? Yeah, can you go around again? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm totally joking. Can I just hold your arm so I feel hey, better? Man, this is bloody stupid. Like, mate, it is so dark. Pete, don't let go of me! Oh, don't tell me, don't tell me! Hang on. Don't say that, don't say that. Oh, hang on, there's something there. Don't say that, it's not funny. Oh, no way to not be. For fuck's sake, Pete, stop laughing. <laughs> this is so oh. Tony, Tony, oh, hold me, God. hold me, Tony. Hold me. His name's Tony, nuts. Hold the start. Swinging. Well, what are we supposed to be doing? I don't know, I thought it was supposed to be something in here. I swear to God, my mouth is not no. fucking swinging. For sake, uh, oh, don't touch me, don't touch me. What is that? What is, what is that? That's me. Wait, 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 wait. If that's you, that's me. If I punch anyone, I'm really fucking sorry, man. Hey, don't go, don't go, don't go. <sighs> just don't move. Why oh, are we just... What's the flashing? What is the flashing? What is that? that? Hang on, I'm fucking standing. Oh, my God, what the fuck just touched me? What, what the, the fuck, fuck was that? Jake fucking else, Jake, man, chill out. Oh my god, something's pushed. Don't, something's touched me. This isn't funny. Whoever that is, stop. <laughs> stop now, I'm not getting paid enough for this. Oh my god, stop touching me. Don't let go, Pete. Oh, oh I just hold okay, the wall. wall. Just hold the wall. Don't. Oh my god. What? No, that's not funny. Stop. 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 That wasn't funny. Oh, God. Oh, I hate mm. being jumped out at. It's not funny. Oh, God's God. sake. Makeup's going to run now. Oh, Christ's sakes. Where's 
That's us locked in there. We ain't getting out this way. There's a brick wall behind you. We have to work together to solve the clues to be released. Oh my God, please. I mean, you've got to get yourself together. Oh, get together. This is yeah. a fucking nightmare because you haven't noticed. Hey, enough. Uh, enough? Have you forgotten who I am? I'm sure he hasn't. <laughs> I said, have you fucking forgotten who I am? Oh, I haven't. Trust me. <laughs> I'm sorry, was you just laughing at me? Was he just fucking laughing at me? Uh, yeah, I was laughing at you. But just you remember our conversation regarding money? Oh, and think about the next words out of your mouth. <laughs> because I was the one that made you on the love nest. <laughs> Unless you want to go back to your shitty minimum wage. Maybe we should get into the spirit of things, eh? Start looking for clues? Yeah, that's how this works. I'm here to help. Do you know the way out? You work here. I don't. I didn't set this room up. Don't these places usually have some sort of clues of some kind? Yeah, something like that. Yeah, something like that. Oi, stop. What? Quinn, we've got to get clues. Clues? Yes, an escape room. So do you want to get out or not? I want out. Except you've got to help us find stuff. <sighs> That's why we pay people to work for us, babe, so we don't have to look. Fine. Fucking idiots. No, why don't we just wait it out? Nothing ever good comes from looking anyway. Brilliant, I'll just talk to myself. Look, I... I'm fucking fine. Great. I'll join your shitty Boy Scout Brigade. I can't see a thing. It's not going to be easy, is it? I'm going to leave the key lying about. Well, I was hoping. I bet you were. Maybe we should force our way out. I'd be surprised if it was that easy. Why don't we just wait for some instructions? I'm actually not a huge fan of waiting. I agree. This place is creeps, Phil. Mm. Yeah, you're quick to agree with him, aren't you? Uh, that's it's just... <laughs> what, it's just an observation, that's all. I just don't see what good it'll do. Yeah, for once, I actually agree with you. Why do you employ him? Oh, because she needs me. I'd mean, say you need her a little bit more, pal. Oh, and how do you reckon that, then? Uh, well, I reckon who speaks... How do I reckon that? Because I think you think that she's just one of them shitty little celebrities like I am. Yeah, you both are. Guys, this won't get us anywhere. What did you just say? Hey guys, take a look at this. What do you reckon? Oh, I reckon that's a vent. Maybe we should look in there for clues. Ah, so you do know the way out then. So I'm volunteering. Come on. Come on. <sighs> Well, do you see anything? Yeah. Nay. No. Oh my god, this is such bollocks. Wait, you can hear something. What, what is it? Sounds like some sort of hissing. Some sort of hissing sound. A what? What did she say? She said hissing. Wash your ears out, you prick. Oh, why don't we have calm down? Something's not right. Oh, spoon, catch, 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 catch. oh my fucking god! Oh, oh, oh. Shit, Gabby! Wait, what is that? Some kind of. Jesus, it's gas! Yeah, we need to, uh. Please get out of here. I'm just. Oh my god! Oh, Pete! Fucking let us out! This isn't fun anymore! This isn't funny! Come on! We don't want to do this anymore! Let us out! Stay there, that's it, stay there. 
Oh, good, yeah. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so turn the face on. Turn the face on. Right, so the reason you're in this room is because it's haunted, for real. Okay. Okay. And uh, sometimes we get things happen in this room. And it's usually a little child um, running around. And uh, apparently his name's Charlie. And, uh, <laughs> all right, Suze, calm down, yeah. Don't tell me to calm down, all right? Well, can you get out of this, then, big man? No, it's no good. I can't get out of them. What the hell is this? Oh, I'm getting angry now. I don't want to play these stupid games anymore. Whoever's behind this, let me go, and I'll make it easy for you. I'm a very important man. <laughs> What's that? Yeah, what the hell is all that? We need to get out of here. Yeah, and we will. It's just a prank. Prank? We got gas, for God's sake. I didn't plan this. You have all been chosen. Chosen to tell the truth. There is a riddle. And a truth. Solve the riddle. And tell the truth. And you will be released. If you don't, you will suffer the consequences. Humanity is an imperfect organism that shouldn't exist. Each one of us capable of horrible acts. Even the most innocent of souls are tainted by acts of evil. What is this shit? Riddle and truth. Riddle and truth. In front of you, you have items. Each one representing a riddle. Each item have an importance to you. Each item bearing the scars and weight of your misdeeds and evil acts. Shut up, you prick! Three minutes for your riddle and truth. If you do not answer with your truth, you will be judged. Fuck off. Contestant one, Pete. Oh, God, what a load of old shite. What is this? The voice said riddle and truth. What does that even mean? Oh, 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 who gives a shit? Well, he obviously wants you to play. I obviously don't want to play, do I? The voice said those items are important. <laughs> yeah, I saw your face go when you clocked them. It's got you so riled up. Look, why don't you just try and figure out of this, yeah? Well, last time I checked, Suze, you aren't exactly the sharpest tool in the box, are you? Fuck you. <laughs> oh, look, oh, we're counting down. But we're trying to get the fuck out of here, then, eh? Well, maybe you should try. Don't remember asking the help for opinions. Well, ugh, what does Rill and Truth even bloody mean? Oh, uh, give a shit. Hey, ah, uh, God, I fucking hate you. Maybe we should just try and get into the spirit of things, yeah? Oh, mate, what is your deal? Oh, what's your deal? Do you want to get out of here? Yeah. And I'm going to sit here and I'm going to wait for that clock to tick down to fucking zero. And when it does, some pimply little prick. He's going to come in here, he's going to fucking open that door. No, oh, just open it, will he? Yeah. And when he does, fuck him. Let me out and fucking break his jaw, mate. Look, time's almost gone. Look, it's like New Year's. Yeah, it is a countdown to nothing. I want to see your faces. Pete! Yes, you're hiding. Maybe just play ball, yeah? 
No! This is wrong. This is seriously wrong. We need to get out of here. Oh, you bunch of twats. Oh, look, oh, oh. Like I said, now Sue's can. Think. We need to oh think. Oh God! <laughs> no, no. What do I do? What did I do? <laughs> shut up! Just shut up! The voice said riddle and truth. What does that mean to you? What does that even mean? Riddle and truth. Look, mate. I need to get out of here. I can't die in here. Not like this. One of those items. Some of them must mean something. Oh, yeah. The items on the table, one of them must mean something to you. They don't. They don't mean anything. They're a clue, some sort of clue. I can't see a clue, Jesus Christ! Think, something, anything. The money, the money! What about it? Look, I've got a cocaine problem, I sniff coke, all right? to really attract people. So, his name's Charlie. Oh, God! Oh, my God! <laughs> okay, yeah. Okay, okay. Okay, yeah. no, you don't. Okay, you can find Bob back. Okay. Thank you. Okay, he's <laughs> on the door. Okay. <laughs> what does that mean? What does that mean? Maybe he made it. Okay, sweetheart. It's okay, we just need to think, yeah? I can't. I can't. Oh my god, you're so pathetic! Fuck you! You're so good? Is that why Pete came to me? What did you just say? They said, is that why Pete came to me? <laughs> bitch, you fucking bitch! No, no! That's it, isn't it? What? That's your truth. You had an affair with Pete. You fucking bitch. Go on, say it. I had an affair with Pete. I had an affair with Pete. Say it again. I had an affair with Pete. Oh, God. I can't die. I can't die. Stop. 
You're not gonna die. Riddle. It can't just be the truth. It has to be the riddle. One of the items on the table. One of them means something. Look at them. Concentrate. The chocolates. Those chocolates. Those the ones he got me. You fucking bitch. You got me those chocolates and. Welcome to Fight Club. Now, the first rule of Fight Club is that we don't talk about Fight Club. The second rule of Fight Club is that we don't talk about Fight Club. Now, ladies and gentlemen, you've reached a critical stage. It's the 15th round of this incredible match with these incredible fighters. So, in the right corner, weighing in at an impressive 112 kilos, the unstoppable sex machine, 26 KOs of 32 professional fights, the Elf of Norwich! In the left corner, weighing in at 86 kilos, 36 professional fights, of which 27 are KOs. The Dagger Destroyer, Dennis <laughs> Okay, guys, right. Watch your kidney punches and box! Who's next then? Next contestant. Drink. Uh, no. 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 What do you mean? Just, just figure it out. Just figure it out. He already knows. The voice already knows the truth. Just, just say it. No. Jesus Christ, what the, what the fuck are you doing? We need to break out of here. Just, just answer the question, riddle and true. Answer it. No. What did you do? What did you do? It's that picture, isn't it? It's that fucking picture of yours. Wait, I, I recognise that kid. Why do I recognise that kid's face? Shut your face. You hear me? You just shut your face. I know. She had a name. It was, it was on the news. Um, it was on the news a, a year ago. She was, she was killed in a, killed in a hit and run. Shut your mouth. You ran over her and ran away, you prick! What does that mean? What does that mean? Disqualification. Wrong contestant. What? What do you mean, wrong contestant? What does that mean?
Nice. 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 Nice.
So, if you turn around like that. Okay, I think okay. Okay. You need I'm going to tell you a story, ghost story. Okay. You need to move your blindfold. Keep your eyes closed. Yeah. Move your blindfold. I'm going to tell you a story. Okay. Turn your mouth. Now you can open your eyes. Open your eyes. Oh. Yeah? Is it dark? It's very dark. It's very dark, we can't see a thing. But apparently there's a ghost here called Charlie. And he does haunt. <laughs> and he does haunt a lot. Fuck! <laughs> okay, okay. okay. <laughs> I've got you, I've got you. Turn it on, turn it on. Okay. <laughs>
And so you'll go through it. Okay? And so you will go through it. Make sure you move your pipe and keep it in your hand. Give you that. Okay? Can you see anything? No. Nothing? No. No. Okay. So, there's a ghost there called Charlie. Did you see him? No. Sometimes he does. Okay, let's see. <laughs> okay, turn around you. Okay, there you go. Okay. To admit, I'm really fucking impressed. You've got some serious balls on you. Fuck! How you did are you... such a pathetic fucking bitch. Do you know that? What? It was me. It was my idea. I should have had your life. I wouldn't have ruined it like you did. I wouldn't have thrown it away. Uh, but. But you've been in the room the whole time. It was pre-recorded. <gasps> you bitch! Oh, sticks and stones. Why? I should have had your life. I wouldn't have ruined it like you did. I would have done something if I'd gotten on that show instead of you. Not you. You really fucked your way in, didn't you? But this? I have to admit, this is really impressive. This must have taken some doing. How does it feel? How does it feel to fight for something else? To fight for your life? Fucking stupid, you'd probably still be alive. What? No!